What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today I want to do a quick little vlog to tell you guys about what happened with the Liberty Watch C8. So in August 2020, I picked up my C8 Corvette in Jacksonville. I immediately started learning about the car. I wanted to track it. So I went to Ron Fellows Driving School in Vegas. If you guys have not done that and you own a C8, you should really jump on that bandwagon. You get to rip on one of their cars for two days around their track and they teach you everything about the car. I learned all about the car, fell in love with it. It was an amazing car. I thought they went from C7 to like C10. The car was just amazing. It handled so well around the track. Ended up falling in love with that car for the track capability. So immediately after that, I started doing a lot of racing videos, drag racing, track days, but without the ability to tune the car, it got kind of boring. You know, I couldn't get any faster. I was just staying at a consistent speed of the drag strip or even on the track, you know, once you learn the car, you just want to, you know, Go faster and go faster. Think about a year into having the car, Pro Charger announced they were coming out with their Pro Charger. So I jumped right on that. I was like, wow, this is the first time we're gonna be able to add power to the car. I was so excited. I immediately uh, bought the entire kit and waited. Waited a really long time, about a year. And you know, every two months or so, I'd call them, get, try to get an update. Say, hey, when's this kit coming out? And they'd be like, oh, you know, we got more testing to do, da, 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 two more months, two more months, two more months. So I ended up canceling the Pro Charger, and thank goodness I did, because they just basically started getting those things working pretty pretty good now. After we installed the Liberty Walk kit, I fell in love with the car again. Nothing out there like it. I was really enjoying the car. Had a really good time. But then my past got back to me. Like, I wanted to get back on the track. I wanted a drag race. And that car, once you Liberty Walk it, wide body it, uh, there's some wheels and tires, all that stuff. It's too pretty. You don't you don't want to mess it up, and especially all the money you put into it. You, you don't want to mess all that up. So then the car became kind of boring again. I found out my passion isn't customizing cars to make them look, you know, like show cars and stuff. I found out my passion is is racing. Like I love racing. I love being on the track. I love drag racing. Like if I could do a job for free for the rest of my life. It'd be a race car driver. But I knew the Z06 was coming. It was just a matter of time. We just didn't know exactly when. So I was waiting for that. But unfortunately, because I wasn't really passionate about the show car thing, I stopped making videos on YouTube. I stopped being consistent. And because I stopped being consistent, I kind of killed my dream of trying to own every single variant of the C8. The YouTube revenue wasn't there. I wasn't making content, so. I couldn't keep that car and the incoming Z06, so I had to sell it. I was 27 in line originally at my dealership, and you know I started walking down on the numbers. I got down to I think in the single digits, and that's when I realized that you know I could be up in the next order cycle or two. So I posted her for sale back in March of this year, 2023. Within about a day or two, I had about three offers, and I ended up selling to a guy in Texas. The guy's name is Kyle, he's on Instagram. If you guys wanna follow his profile on Instagram, I'll go and link that in the description below. Like I said, I was gonna vlog it. I did make some content. I was just really sad and depressed, and I just didn't wanna share that. But here's a clip from it getting loaded on that truck. About one month from that day, I got a phone call from Chevrolet, and that's when everything got better. They said, my Z06 order was up. I went ahead and placed my order. Now we have this beast, and I'm super happy, and I can't wait to bring you guys a ton of content. I'm gonna stay super consistent. I'm gonna try to get videos up every other day. So be on the lookout, guys, but that's why I'm the Liberty Walk C8. Thanks for watching. We'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.